I'm going to demonstrate to you how to plant up a trough with summer bedding plants. So I've chosen a 60 centimetre trough and first of all I've cut three drainage holes in the bottom. Next take the compost and we'll just fill this up to about a couple of inches of the top. Now I'm going to incorporate some slow release fertiliser into the compost and this is just to keep the plants fed throughout the summer. So I think we'll put about one and a half scoops in here. Just spread it around and give it a good mix in. And then it's time to pick up your plants and start placing them. Now we've got the two large ones. These are fuchsias. I'm going to place these just at the back here. Around there. I like to place the plants in first and then plant them up and I don't know where everything's going. And we've got some bacopa. Now these are trailers, so these are better really near the front because this is a window box. So the back's not going to be too important. So I'll place one at each end and then one in the middle. Got these two small calibre cores. These are going to sit just behind the bacopa there I think. And that looks good to me. And then I think I'll just fill these gaps in with any other plants which have some petunias and lobelia. So, let's pop them out. And we'll take the fuchsias out of the pots. And place that in there. And that one there. Then the three bacopa. Now, don't be scared if they're slightly out of place. You can always adjust them, move them along. You get a lot better picture once they're all placed. So, they just need shuffling along slightly. And then the two calibre core. Now, these will trail slightly, but they'll also stand up and bring a bit of colour under the bacopa. Now, in these corners, nothing else is going there, so I can fill in with a little bit of compost. Just tuck them in nicely. Not too much, you want a little gap at the top, just for when you're watering. So the water goes in the trough, and not everywhere else. Now next, I've got some lobelia. These are great little hole fillers. You can just pop them in. And don't be scared of packing them too tight because that's the trick to a nice hanging basket or trough. Now I'll put these on each end and make it nice and regular. And they will fill out slightly, so I can give them a little bit more room. And then with the gap at the back here, I'm just going to put two petunias. One in there. And one next to it there. Then all we need to do is fill in them gaps with some compost. Now, I've used Jack's Magic Compost, and that's because I've had really good results from it in the past. And once I get good results, I'll stick to that one. Just carry on filling all these little gaps. Don't worry if you can't get in all the small crevices, because when you water it, the compost will run into them. As long as the main parts are filled. And then in the summer, the bacopa is going to trail right over the front and the edges. There's some nice white flowers there. 
Got the Belia coming through, which is a mix, and that's going to come through. And the Calibre Core will just grow right over them with the Petunias and Fuchsia at the back, looking proud and smart. And now we're done. Just tidy it up a bit. Give it a water and you've got your very own window trough.